Hello guys, this is Sajid. Today we are going to study how to add drag and drop file upload functionality for your website. On my screen, you can see that I have created a file zone where user can drop the file or even they can choose the file by the traditional way as well. So here is my code. This is my main container. The container you are seeing on my web page, this one. Now I have given the ID drop file zone. I have used JavaScript method on drop, on drag over, return false. Now I have declared one more div. I have given one ID for it, drop file here or input type button value select file this one and on click file explorer and here i have given input type file id select file so here i use little trick to given this file choose option for user by default we can't open the file explorer on the input type button so i add little trick here I add input type file and make it display none here. Now on the click of this button I am calling file explorer function here and under this function I fire the click event for this input type file and after once we select the file I get the object of that selected file by using this JavaScript method selector dot files of zero index. This will return the file object of this selected file and this file object we are passing to this function. This function we are, use, we are using twice here. Means this one is for the traditional file choose option and this function we call on drop event is whenever user drop the file in your file zone this function get call this function also get the file object of the drop file and pass the same object to the ajax file upload next one is in this function we give a call to ajax file because after all we have to move selected file on the server and for that we need to write the server side programming so here we are building the object form data dot append and passing this data to the url ajax dot php file and once we get the response we again make the value empty for the input type file because why this is need to do was once you selected file and your process get completed your file get uploaded on server you need to make it empty to choose the another file and this is our ajax file code it's a simple code means we are checking plus first file types we are allowing only these four kind of files to upload on our server. If selected file type is not amongst, among these file types, then it will return false. If it is among these file types, then it go ahead. It will create one directory called uploads on our server and then this is the PHP function. For uploading your file on server that's it now let's take a look at it now I choose the file and drop here what happened yeah file uploaded successfully now I go to my 
server folder yeah here it create uploads directory yeah this is the file i uploaded just now so it's about drop file now i choose the file and choose another file to upload step 5 file uploaded successfully now go to your yeah here file uploaded successfully so it's all about drag drop file upload functionality for your website it's a very simple to integrate now yeah that's all so i hope you understand your tutorial if you have any doubt or suggestions please leave a comment below thanks for watching video have a nice day